And this is something everyone knows but rarely says, and that is this, that once the number of non-whites reaches a certain level in an area, whites will not or cannot stay. They refuse to be a minority. They move away from those places where they have become minorities, and they seek solace in those places where they are once again a majority. This is an empirical, utterly dependable phen phenomenon, and it's a fact that everyone, and I mean everyone, knows this to be true, little though they may wish to talk about it. The process simply doesn't work the other way. Not even the most ardent integrationist is willing to take the most obvious step to make integration really come about. That is to say, to buy a house in a black neighborhood, or move into a Mexican neighborhood, or even for that matter, in many cases, send their children to public school. As far as whites are concerned, once a school or a part of a city has gone majority black or Hispanic, or even Asian in some cases, it might as well have disappeared from the map of their city. It becomes terra incognita, a little bit like those portions of ancient maps that used to say, here be dragons. What was once part of our nation and part of our civilization has slipped its leash. Therefore, one thing that we can say with complete certainty about the demographic change of the, in the United States is that whites will withdraw from more and more parts of their country. It will, of course, be physically possible for whites to live with the Mexicans in Brownsville, Texas, or with blacks in Camden, New Jersey, but most will do just about everything possible to avoid it. Because the fact is, many of us can think of neighborhoods, of towns, of villages, places where we would like to live. And it's almost a certainty that if a white person is thinking of these places, they'll all have large white majorities. And by the same token, it would be difficult for any white person in the United States to name a single neighborhood or town in which you would wish to live that does not have a white majority. 